those guys just want to kill me. Those guys just want to kill me. Those guys don't give a shit. And... Hmm. Now, I do remember that, um... That guy is going in there to drop off some drugs in the, uh, in the toilet. So, I'll just wait for him to come out. In the meantime, let's just talk to these guys for some reason. Oh. The young pump leaves, looking pleased with himself. Okay, let's go to the toilet. Turn the light on. And look, flashing something in the trash can. A small clear plastic bag. I'm sure it's just sugar. Don't use the toilet bowl, you'll die. And turn off the light, and I'm going to take my leave rather quickly, if you don't mind, because that's uh, probably for somebody else. <laughs> uh, I probably should leave the clipboard there, there's no real. So let's have a look. It contains cocaine! <gasps> I'm shocked! It may not be a good idea to take other people's money, but it would be grossly immoral to leave drugs where any innocent citizen can find them. Yeah, uh, <laughs> right. <laughs> Unmarked. Yeah, I wonder what's really on it. Probably just stag. It's no wonder he left so quick. Um, right. So the question is now. Oh, I need to go to the toilet. Oh, I better go. Huh, what a great bit of detail. You relieve yourself and note the smooth efficiency of your bodily functions with understandable satisfaction. In line with correct social behaviour guidelines, you flush the toilet. And there's no wash basin, so... Brilliant. Disgusting. Um, right, well that, that, that was fairly successful, but I still don't really know how to get into Saitenko's place. So, I'm going to save again. And let's just try to talk it out of Saitenko here. A beefy man opens the apartment door. What can I do for you? Anatoly Saitenko? Yes? Ah, uh, let's see. Tell me about your meat shop, Saitenko. What about it? Your so-called clients are mafia types, aren't they? That's crap. What's your game anyway? Uh, what if the militia made an inspection? Whoever you are, you've come to the wrong place. In that case, I apologise. Uh, need your head examined. Nah. Okay, I think I need more. Let's try that again. Oh, no, that's the map. Okay. Um, it's a bit confusing, but in any case. Um, right, let's try that again. Rating 11. Yay, I'm doing well. Okay. What can I do for you? And... Let's risk it. I'm looking for a man called Hollywood. I don't suppose. Sorry, try the club. Oh, damn it. Okay, fine. Yeah, I'm kind of stuck again. Um, I remember bits and pieces. meat. This is Russia, comrade, and there isn't much blah 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 blah. Time uh, your so-called clients are mafia types, aren't they? Maybe you're kind of the wrong place, your relax running out, comrade, you need a head examined. Okay, it's not going to work. I can't talk it out of him, but I want to keep that. Because if I... You're going to get to talk to him once, and then it, like, you know, ends the whole thing. Um... Hmm... Maybe if, maybe if I wait long enough, this woman will go to bed, uh, they're both going to bed, okay. Am I really desperate enough to try Yasukev? I guess I am. Were you followed? Uh, no. Are you sure? Quite sure. Uh, almost sure. Almost! I won't do! I can't break the seal! I can't let you in! Oh, shit. Uh, you must allow me to pray. Good night. Okay, fuck. It's so easy to screw things up. God damn it. So like the, the, it's one thing I really don't like about these old games, but it really does make it challenging. Uh, comrade Yasukev? How did you get my name? Did they send you? No. Thank God. Who are you? I'm a friend. Do you want to enter? Yes. I'm getting the voices mixed up. <laughs> he glances up and down the corridor and shuts the door. Look at his weird apartment. The seal. Yes, we are safe. <laughs> I've done this before, but... Um, yeah. Comfortable room. Okay. <laughs> um, I don't know if there's anything really useful I can talk to him about. 
many of us in general. Condemned, all of them, except the evil one's servants. Yeah. Glass of water? I can't give you water. It would poison anyone except me. That's the protection, you see. Poor guy. Yes, I care for of yours. Clement Kruglov. Kruglov? No, the numbers are wrong. Mm. He knows that it's not my real name. Uh, ask about. Let's keep it relevant. See if any of the specific. Uh, ask about the set tankers. Condemned! Okay. Uh, no. Nope. Ask about. Progress Club. The Den of Devery. I can feel the evil. The cackle of vice. Chef, that's the old lady. Condemned. Who isn't condemned? Uh, hmm. The person who isn't condemned, the Bilisov's condemned, may be the bad guy. Because he's. Oops. Uh, let's go out. Number keeps condemned. Ask about. You love us. You dare to rap with that? Oh, which one's the you love? I think it's Raymond, isn't it? Oh. Okay. Hmm. Ask about him. I'm fighting a losing battle, I know it. But every act of resistance against the dark one gains precious seconds. They're waiting, and I'll make them wait. Yeah, I uh, don't think there's too much to be gained from this guy. But who knows? This game. At least it's logical. Some some of these games are just bizarre logic, but. This seems like there's at least some... I'll pray for you. Yeah, you do that. Um, that's just a toilet. Uh, there's nothing in here of any use, I don't think. It's very dark and it's on the light on you, know. No. Okay, stuck again. Um, hmm. There's got to be a way into the meat shop. Well, nothing better to do. Let's uh, go get the shit kicked out of us by some... Uh, uh, some of these guys. Ask about the club. Look for yourself. Yeah, you got eyes. No, All right, Petka. Shut up, Leonka. You sure, you don't want to come with us to the party? Worth a try, no? Sure, let's do it. You follow smart Petka and stupid Leonka out of the club and down the street to behind the building. Sorry about this, but you have to show us what in your what's in your pockets. Security. Uh, let's fight. Start with Leonka, the big guy. Smack. And down you go! Yonka's a heavyweight, but he's no match for you. You chop him to the ground, his companion takes to the heels. Right, let's see what he's got. Oh, a lockpick! Yes! Okay, I'm gonna have to move this guy. Um... <laughs> oh god, this is... I think st oh shit, what are you playing at? Uh... I was just trying to help this drunken fall to his feet. Where have you been? We're waiting for you. What? I was delayed. That's bad. Very bad. What happened? Uh, I had a few things to do. That's too bad. Don't be late tomorrow. What the fuck was that all about? Don't be too risky. What? I guess I went the wrong way. Um. Ah, here we go. Stick it in the bin. <sighs> Nasty. Standard issue. You find a body. <laughs> no, I don't want to take it. Okay. Wow. Right, now I have a lockpick. God, somebody had to bloody have the shit kicked. I might have killed him, I don't know. Oh well, whatever it takes to serve Mother Russia. Okay, let's pick the lock. Oh, it's clearly bolted on the inside. Oh no, well, what do I, there must be, there's that other lock. Oh, there we go. Nothing too difficult about the lock. With a soft click, it opens. Here we go, okay. Now, uh, some kind of restroom. Cupboard, nothing special. A table, the fridge. Looks like it should have been retired 20 years ago. Last room. Let's turn the light off as we go. Uh, oh, oh! This is the meat shop. Oh, wait, where's the light switch? Damn it! Oh, there we go. Not a very discreet thing to do, comrade. Okay, so this is the back door to the. Uh, this, yeah, let's use. Oh, there's a bit of meat. The shop couldn't pass a sanitary inspection. The counter, blood stained. Yeah, cash desk. 
Still beneath the cash deck is the switch, which is a red diode. The diode emits no light. You inspect the switch and diode. Plastic coating wire runs discreetly from the switch box to the wall and continues where it disappears under the frame of the cold room door at door handle height. Hmm. Well, that could be a panic button or something. Now, which one did that come from? Oh, that's, yeah, okay. Let's go through here. With a hiss, the heavy door closes behind you. No! Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I was trapped. It's dark in here. Okay. One more match. I'm running out of matches here. The carcasses are human. The victims were clearly tortured and mutilated before dying. You throw up violently in disgust and horror. The butcher must be a psychopath. It's cold. Uh, oh, there was a light switch. Okay, never mind. <laughs> oh. Can you imagine standing in this fucking room with corpses there? With only a light of a candle. I'm gonna leave! Okay, um... Uh, yeah. This is horrific. Obviously now I've got something to go talk to Saitenko about. Where is he? Obviously he's just been used. These gangster types who... There we go. No answer? What?! I don't believe it! How is there no answer? Is it too late? Oh. Alright, let me just try to do that all again. Uh -huh. So it seems that um, whenever I go in the meat shop, it uh, causes Sotenko to stop answering the door. So I'm thinking maybe I should uh, do something with that diet. Maybe that sort of prevents an alarm going off or something. Or maybe it's the other way around. Maybe if I go in there and then... Okay, let's turn the light switch on. Look at the bodies. Oh, puking, horrible nastiness. Turn the light off. Leave. Now, let's uh, see if that has done anything to the... Uh, Dynamite's no light. Okay, let's flip the switch, see what happens. Um, Spec the switch. Yeah, I... Right, it goes into the cold room. Maybe I should have done that before. Well, let's find out. I'm just going to go and try to talk to Setenko and see what happens. I think I did that in the wrong order. I think, like, it's some kind of... It disables the alarm or something, so... Yeah, no answer. He's... he's. Uh, I think Setenko is waiting for that guy. Or some, some member of this horrible killing people and torturing them organization. Um, yeah, I'm just rushing through this now. Ask about work, varies, party, yes, uh, yes. Let's go to a party. A party where you get your sh... Where you try to fight the wrong guy. Smack. Loot the corpse. <laughs> it's like an RPG. Move the body. It's not like an RPG. Oh shit, oh no, he's academy here. What are you playing at? Ah, uh, this fellow just passed out right in front of me. Where have you been? We were waiting for you. He looks shady. He's lighting a cigarette and it's illuminating his face. Uh, I was waiting too. Here? Uh, I couldn't get to the other place. Couldn't get the sashes? That's a good one. See you tomorrow. What? Yeah. I don't know. Um, in any case, let's quickly... Uh... Yeah, because if you don't... Um, put that body away then he'll uh, he'll arouse suspicion and the police will be summoned and your whole undercover thing will be fucked so let's uh, let's try this again so the the, um, the 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 switch leads to the uh, to the meat room yeah to the cold room door door handle height right it it's an alarm which Okay, flick the switch, and then go through there, and it won't set off the alarm, I suspect. This is this is obviously because they're worried about... They want to know if somebody fucks up, fucks up with their shit. So, inspect human horribleness. Oh my god, puke, blah, blah, blah. And, uh, leave, please. And... Now, should I switch it back? That's the question. The waste another... 
Uh, flick the switch again. I'm trying to use common sense. So that, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> right, let's see if we can talk to him now. Yes! A beefy man opens the apartment door. 